the commodity code. How to find the correct code. You'll need a commodity code to make your customs declaration when you bring goods in or out of the UK. This includes goods sent to you from abroad. If you classify your goods correctly, you'll know what rate of duty and import VAT you should pay or if the duty is suspended. You'll also find out if you need a license to move your goods or if your goods are covered by the common agricultural policy, anti-dumping duties or tariff quotas. The UK Commodity Code takes its first six digits from the HS code. These harmonised system codes are an international standard for calculating import duty tax controlled by the World Customs Organisation, first introduced in 1988. Each HS code describes a particular trade product which allows governments around the world to charge the right tariffs. In Europe, a combined nomenclature has been added so the seventh and eight digits identify the CN subheadings. When you classify, you should know what type of product it is and for which purpose it is produced, the type of material used or the production method. Here you see the structure of the commodity code. If you search the correct code for men's trousers made of cotton and knitted in its construction, you'll need to navigate to chapter 61, apparel and clothing. In the HS heading, you choose between men and boys trousers. In the subheading, you define trousers. And finally, select the material cotton. This gives us the commodity code of 61, 034200. But now let's see how this works on the government website. First check out HMRC guidance, then go to the tariff tool. A quick way of doing this is going to a Google search and search for HMRC trade tariff tool. This should return several options for the UK government website. We want to select the second option using the trade tariff tool. This should take us to the gov.uk website, using the trade tariff tool to find a commodity code. If we scroll down, we need to select use the trade tariff tool to find your code. Select this. Select the green start now button. From here, the trade tariff is displayed. We scroll down to the goods that best describe our product. From this, we need to choose the chapter that best matches our goods. We select articles of apparel and clothing accessories. From here, we can see that the first two digits of our commodity code have already been selected, 61. At this point, we need to choose the heading that best matches our goods. We select 03 men or boys suits, ensembles, jackets, blazers and trousers. As you can see, the third and fourth digit have now been calculated. We need to choose the commodity code that best matches our goods. At this point, we can see the section trousers, bib and brace overalls, of which we now can select of cotton. At this point, we can see our commodity code of 6103 4200 have now been selected. But what if you need more than one, 100, or even a thousand commodity codes? Perhaps an automatic proposal would be useful. And if you want your system to learn about the choices you've already made in the past, you can use the software to learn from those past decisions. And perhaps having this technology streamlined and connected to your ERP could accurately and efficiently improve the process. Check out the advantages of AEB classification on our website.